Hey, what's going on everyone? Today is December 6th, 2022. We're going to talk about ICP crypto today. Internet computer, you guys can see that the resistance area has been revisited in the market for ICP. So I wanted to come in and speak to you all as to how can, what should we look forward to now into the market action for ICP? You guys can see this right here. Just yesterday, December the 5th, the market ran all the way up here to our resistance area and came back down. Hmm, pretty good call. 11 and a quarter percent profitability right there. Not surprised to see that happen, but we do need to plan forward. We need to think now that since price in ICP got rejected here, are we still bullish? Are we going to expect the price to continue to go up or down momentarily? Because that was the crossroads. You guys can see where both of those lines intersect. And we are still seeing the price as of today, as of right now, trading below that trend line. So generally, if we were to put a spin on the market right now in ICP, we need to say that overall the market is weaker than it is given the strength right now, all because of price trading below those two lines. That's it. So right now, are we looking for price to go up in ICP? No, not yet. Now, if we would have seen the market do this, then definitely we would be a little bit more bullish. But that didn't happen. Instead, the market got rejected and now we're seeing price come back down. So how low do you think the market's going to go in ICP? Maybe not that low, maybe to four dollars and 15 cents to four dollars before we see another attempt for the market in ICP to try to break the downtrend line. Let's take a look at this on the two day real quick. OK, so you guys can see right here, even on two days, we're noticing that selling is here or at least the lack of demand for people trying to come in and purchase this crypto at that price. They're not here yet. OK, so you can see that there on the two day. Here it is on the three day chart. Uh, pretty mixed on this last completed three day price bar. So we would have to go with in terms of where price open and close on this price bar with the high volume. We have to go with price getting rejected right there around four dollars and sixty cents coming down that the sellers actually won in terms of moving price over the last three days. Here it is on the five day. OK, so we have 12 hours and 14 minutes left. And again, it's just showing us that sellers are currently selling into the market in ICP right there around four dollars and sixty cents. Let me look at this on the hourly chart because literally we just need to try to determine how low price is going to go. OK, so look at this, too. So looking at this on the five hour chart. OK, this is the trend. So we need to focus on how low price is going to go in ICP. So creating this trend line down here, we can actually see price come in the market in ICP four dollars and thirty cents to four twenty. No lower than four ten in order for us to continue to look forward to price going up. That's it. OK, that's it on the five hour chart. Let me see this on the three. And yes, we're still seeing some weakness here on the three hour chart, albeit it's not that weak. We're just seeing lack of interest or, or people trying to buy ICP at these price levels. So the market's going to continue to go down until it finds a price that it can induce more people to try to come in and buy this cryptocurrency. OK, so what I'm going to do on this particular video is I'm going to sit the sideline, which you don't have to. But I'm going to sit the sideline because I want the buyers to tell me how high or at what price are they willing to come in and buy this cryptocurrency? I really don't see it just yet. We're just meandering up here around four dollars and fifty cents, four dollars and twenty five cents. I want them to show us by volume that they're really coming in and buying this cryptocurrency at those prices. As of right now, I don't see that. So it tells me that the market is currently mixed. It's trying to figure out which direction it wants to go right now. And overall, the current direction is to the downside. Right. But as time goes on, the bars could step in and confirm that they're still looking to move this market higher. So I'm just going to pause right here. I'm not going to drop a price prediction. Once I get more information uh, as to which side of the market is winning between the buyers and the sellers, and I'll come back in and drop another price prediction so that we can get right back in position and profit. So now give me your thoughts, though. Hit that like button instead of it. Also subscribe to the channel to get more of a simplistic way of understanding price action so that we can at least forecast and try to predict where price is going to go so that we can be in position and actually win.